it's such a pleasure to talk to both of you together. Uh, this experience must have been so much fun, mostly because of the company you keep, right? Yes, for yes. sure. It was a, it was a happy set and. Yeah, it was just fun. It's not bad to go to work with four people you like and, and be directed by somebody who's really, really fun and really good and kind of loves his job. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, were you fans of the first one? Obviously, it's the most cliche question. Yeah. I can ask you. <laughs> it's like no one's it asked you okay. that before ever. Okay. We haven't seen it yet. <laughs> no, or, or heard of it. Yes, yeah. we've yes. never heard of it. I thought this was the, f the, the first one. <laughs> it is. Yeah. We are in denial that <laughs> it's it true, ever it's happened true. before. I did love, no, the, I love first the first one. one. Yeah, it's, I love yeah. the first two. And my I have a six and a nine year old. I have two daughters, and they're crazy about. They, they, they've only seen the first one. We've graduated to the second one. I don't know if the painting will freak them yeah, out. Yeah, probably. But uh, will. they really love it. So it it truly lives large in our house. Uh, obviously, the comedic element is very important to those stories. How much did you girls feel like you infused each one of you, your own comedic style? Because everyone is different in their comedic uh, acting. Um, I, mean, I mean, the script was so well written and, and really defined the characters for us. And then we kind of worked with Paul to make them our own and to make, you know, to like flush them out a little bit. But do you inspire yourselves? I mean, uh, technically. I inspire myself. <laughs> <laughs> no. I am my own um, source. I'm busy inspiring myself <laughs> right now. What inspires you? <laughs> Me. <laughs> this one. Um, no, I think that's. I think that's kind of the the joy of Paul's uh, ability to cast well. That he casts yeah. people that. First of all, he writes for very, very different three-dimensional characters, and then he casts them with people with very different energies, very different kind of styles, but they still come together and work great. And I think that's, then you're not trying to manufacture too much. It's like it's it's kind of built into what we all are, and, and then it just makes it, makes it kind of feel easy. Yeah, yeah that's true. How much does the visual effects element also uh, take importance in the sense that, you know, this is so much making your imagination work all the time? Yeah, people are gonna be surprised yeah. when they see this special I effects. So, I, I think so too. I think they're not expecting how the, the scope of it, how big the movie feels, how kind of incredibly scary. I think for us though, it was so nice that all the ghosts that are in it um, they weren't put in later. They were they were enhanced later. But when there's you know when you see the ghosts, they were there. They were really great actors, completely in prosthetics and makeup yeah, like and LED incredible lights costumes. Under like, their costumes, they were kind of terrifying. Oh, yeah. They were terrifying. Yeah. Like the, there's there's a ghost in the subway, and um, I think he went through six or seven hours of prosthetics, and that's what we were dealing with. Mm. And then on top of that, they enhanced it with like lighting and stuff. But yeah, and he was hanging from yeah. wires, and he was legit scary. Yeah, it was, it was, it <laughs> like was scary. Like fake teeth, and Ooh. yeah. So it was great great to act off of something that was, there's a real person, there's someone in character, and then they also look kind of terrifying, so it was, not, it was much better than looking at a tennis ball. Yeah. True. <laughs> and, and also talking about the, 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 the real element, uh, also a question no one's ever asked you before, about the slime <laughs> and being <laughs> just... Uh, <laughs> it, it sounded very, it seemed very gooey and quite unpleasant, but you're a professional. Yeah, so I never complained about it. Um, <laughs> no, it was, yeah, it was it was gooey and slippery and slimy and, um, but it was, you know, the first time we all got slimed, we were so excited because it's mm. like, it's such you a huge part slimed. of the movie. It's like, it's you're getting like, slimed yeah. in Ghostbusters, it's so cool. Um, yeah, uh, but it was hard to get off. That was the fascination. That was the I hard think just that, like, part. You we were like, what is off. this exactly? <laughs> we still don't know. We still don't know, still what, don't know the, what it was. Uh, made of it. Substance was, but yeah. But I've had skin problems. Since <laughs> so it was shooting. not like organic and non chemical. <laughs> no, it smelled like chlorine and nail polish. Somebody <laughs> said something no. about tapioca flour, some kind of. Oh, that's that good. It was the root of it was tapioca, but. No, enhanced with please a don't bit think of tapioca <laughs> yeah with chlorine and other ungodly things okay you girls are professionals anything they throw at you you just sure. bounce back yes uh, the fans had some questions for you uh, the first question was obviously if you believed in ghosts what would you like them to look like oh I do believe in ghosts I don't know what form or what degree but yeah. I do feel like I think there are there are presence and there are Things or people that energies. are I, energies yeah. that energies, are still kind yeah. of floating, 
in and out of worlds. So I, I think I think everyone's felt something at a certain point. And what I don't know. What do I want it to look like? Like it's that. A good question. True. Like He's that. so cute. I'm yeah. so glad that uh, the, the first one that we that, that we don't know about. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> they just came up with this logo. For Let's go retrospectively yeah. and yes. sue them for copyright. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so what about you, Kirsten, on the question of ghosts? What oh. would you like them to look like well, if you believe? Did them? that? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, no. Yeah. Sure. I mean, I think you. It's easier to say. I mean, wh why not? You can't not mm. believe. Like, how do you know they don't? Exactly. I know a lot of people who have had experiences and, you know, can't discount that. True. Yeah. Me too. Yeah, energies. I, I, yeah. I believe in it uh, uh, a lot. Yeah, uh, me too. A, Another question from the fans is, what do you remember as being your first real movie experience and how much did you enjoy it? <sighs> oh, my gosh. Like the actual first? Yeah. I can't. I don't know what the first one... Mine was. was actually had a little part in one of Paul's movies called oh, Unaccompanied Minors. Right. <laughs> was was like, it your I think first I, movie? Yeah, I think I had one line, like, get out of here or stop that. Um, that was the first one. That was Ben's <laughs> first So I was like, movie. this is easy. And like, I just showed up and like, went to work and then I was done. Um, yeah, because I had one line. Um, yeah, Ben was in it too. Yeah. He played Santa. <laughs> That's so crazy. Oh, what was so my, my, my first movie? Didn't you do that? I did with Kevin Spacey or something. Didn't you do a movie? Yeah, but I think my Jack fucking Jack <laughs> something. Oh, pumpkin. Oh, something? that was. Oh, Kevin Spacey. No, that was uh, Life of David Gale. That's what I was thinking. But of. I think Go was my first mm. first first movie. You were in Go, which I love that movie. I love that. I love that movie, and I didn't know that what continuity was. Because I'd only done theater, <laughs> and I was ripping around this room, picking up things, doing oh nine thousand right. actions. Yes. And this very sweet, very kind script supervisor came up and said, S "You're okay to match that?" And I went, "What do you mean match that?" <laughs> I had no idea. I'd only done like stage stuff, and uh, then I clearly reduced it down to not. <laughs> I had like seventy-five motions. In it, and, and I realized that's not how the talkies work. <laughs> <laughs> but multitasking, a, a woman's job, yes. but multitasking, we, we do it well. Another question quite expected is who was fangirling on uh, uh, Chris Hemsworth the most? Paul. <laughs> For sure. Paul still is like, Paul. he's just so handsome and pretty. Um, and it's so funny. You can't help but, you know funny guys already that's just like come on Charm charming and, and funny, charming funny is and nice and like no ego no um, so down to make himself the butt of the joke yeah and just like what can i do here i am yeah it's it just a delightful great. surprise that that he was so nice i'd always heard he was great but nobody no one had ever really said that he was that funny like i expected him like oh i'm sure he'll it'll be fine I just, I was really, I was surprised that somebody who's that kind of funny, it's not talked about. I just mm -hmm. thought, what, what, what's, this is, seems crazy that yeah. no one's used this before. Yeah, it's a nice vehicle for him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Him. Was he in any way intimidated by all the girl power in this film? I did. Which I enjoyed. I did. <laughs> <Sorry. So. laughs> he seems, Thor. He seems, oh, yeah. <laughs> he seems okay with himself, and I mean that in a, in a healthy way. <laughs> and, and finally, should there be a sequel to our lovely uh, Ghostbusters? How would you like the characters to develop? Where would you like them to go next? I think the first scene we just would be like, well, that was crazy. <laughs> Referring to the first movie. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, anyway. What a we week. Start over. <laughs> what hey, a ba, week. Ba, 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 ba. Remember when we met? <laughs> We just recapped the first one for the first 45 <laughs> minutes. Yeah, exactly. And, and then, then you that add a little bit. Remember, came out remember and this, and we just do flashbacks. It's the easiest. We just cut to the different parts of the first one. And then do that folk version that you did yesterday on the yeah. Graham Norton show. <laughs> Thank you. Joe's getting agitated from the other side of the screen. You're not? <laughs>